guys, this is Shaw Kirby 707, and welcome back to Kirby 64 The Christmas Shards. In the last part, we made it to Rockstar, and today we're going to continue on to more levels in Rockstar. Now, in this level, you want to have two boulders, so you want to have two rock abilities, so make sure you have two boulder abilities. You can find them in the first level of Rockstar, so yeah. Ah, you stupid gavel. I hate these things sometimes. Although I do like them in <laughs> in one episode in Curry Rapid Action. I actually like that one episode with a gavel in it. It was such a cute episode, but <laughs> oh, it was so cute. I haven't seen it in a while. I need to watch it again. It just <laughs> the episode with a gavel was just amazing. Have you guys like have seen like the whole ep the whole episode of Curry Rapid Action? Like all hundred of them? I did. It was pretty cool. It was like a lot of episodes too. <laughs> a lot of them are pretty funny. Oh gosh, I'm getting hit a lot, man. I even got hit at the beginning when I was trying to get the rock ability. Gosh. <laughs> okay, yeah, there's meat over there. Good. And there we go. And I believe you have to go on the this side. I think it is. I think it's this side to get the crystal, but I'm not sure. But I will find out once I defeat this boss. <laughs> All right. I hope it's this one. I hope so. Yes, it is. Okay, so if you go on the left side, if you're in those um, stands in the road, hey, you take the left path, so yeah. Oh, man. Oh, I've been drawing a lot lately. <laughs> and then I've been kind of uploading a video today on on Curry64. <laughs> oh my god, I don't really know what to talk about today. <laughs> um, shoot. I'm still trying to figure out what to do for my 100 subscriber special. I'm still trying to figure out. I haven't really prepared anything yet. Like, if I'm going to do a Q&A question, I might as well try to, well, get, like, no cards and, you know, write questions on it and just say what my answer will be. If you guys have any questions, I feel free to ask. I don't mind at all. But most of the questions that I will answer, most of them that have been questioned for, like, the years of me less playing, some of them are very common questions. I'm like, yes, yes, and no, and all that stuff. But some of them are ridiculous questions. I'm like, really, really, you should know that. <laughs> some of them, some of them are really ridiculous questions. Like, I mean, yeah, they may sound a little off, but I don't know. Some of them are ridiculous. Well, I might as well say it. Okay, I had like a bunch of qu questions saying. Are you a guy? I'm like, yeah, or no, I'm not a guy. I'm a girl. I mean, yes, my voice sounds a little bit, well, not squealy like a girl, but I am a, but I am a girl. <laughs> and then I have like, maybe a few questions saying like, well, if you're not a guy, then you must be a tomboy then. I'm like, yeah, I do consider myself a tomboy because I do like, I'm not really much of a girly girl, so yeah. And these stupid curls are getting your way, so yeah. So that's one of the questions that I might be answering if you guys don't watch this video, but yes. <laughs> For those that are wondering, yes, I am a girl. Oh my goodness, no, the stupid curl's gonna drag me. There, no! Stupid curl, get out of there, stupid curl! Oh my god! Ah! Oh my god! Go over there! Gee, that stupid curl just dragged me all the way to the bottom. What the heck? I've never done that to me before. I usually get out of the way, but for some reason, the core just dragged me all the way to the bottom, man. But yeah, I mean, I get it that some people might ask, like, are you a guy or a girl? Of course, my answer would be like, I'm a girl. Just because my voice sounds like a guy doesn't mean I'm a guy itself. I mean, I can sound squealy and be like, hee 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 hee, but I'm not gonna be all creepy and surely like a girl. I... I, I feel uncomfortable being a really girly girl. I'm, I'm, uh, I like video games and, well, anime and all that stuff, you know. A little boy side to it. And now, oh, shoot. Well, for this area, you do need a, shoot. Pressure the wrong button. I'm not having a great start today. You do need bomb and plasma. So I'm going to go back and get bomb here in a moment. And it's not responding. And this is actually my favorite level. I love this level a lot. As you can see, there's a an upside down pyramid, I guess. It looks really cool looking from far away, so it looks really cool. I really love this level a lot, and I love the music in this level. 
especially the remix of the song. Well, not the song, but the song that we're gonna get into once we get inside the pyramid. I love the song a lot. I like the remix of it in Kirby Camus Curse. And I am not paying attention, gosh. I don't want to lose my bomb ability. I really don't. All right, let's go inside the pyramid. And it looks really high technical, so. It's no, it's no ordinary pyramid or ruins or whatever it is. And I have a feeling I'm gonna die right in this park because of this stupid area right here. These shots though, they're gonna shoot you. If you're not careful, you might die. If you're in this situation right now. Oh my goodness. Do not shoot me! Do not shoot me! Please. Oh my god. Please, I do not want to lose my bomb ability. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Ugh. Oh my, what the? Oh my god. Did you see that? Oh, okay, I'll... I don't know. For some reason, I feel like the the shots were going through the the platform. I don't know. Maybe this version of Kirby 64 in the Kirby Dream Collection looks a little bit off. I don't know. I know Kirby, you're hurting. I know, and I see a sandwich over there, but I'm not gonna get it. Okay, fly, 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 and I do need that ability right there. Okay, get it. Before. Okay. Now, whatever you do, do not get squished in between these platforms, because if you do, it's an instant death, and I'm not gonna go up there. Well, maybe I should have. I, I did have a chance, but... Okay, Kirby, do not do not kill yourself right here. Okay, go, 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 Okay, good. I remember the last time I went through this area, I kind of died by getting squished by those platforms. But anyways, this room is dark, and you see Andalyn, and you can see bl three black holes. They're actually not holes, they're actually paintings. And if you have the bomb, electric, bomb, bomb plasma ability, you can see the picture that she's drawn. So she drew a tree... Sun and a raindrop or water. So tree, sun, raindrop. Alright, tree. Um where's the sun? Sun and raindrop. Now at first I didn't know anything about this puzzle, so I didn't know what to do for that previous room that Anda Lane was at. So yeah. Um shoot. I am I gonna die in this part, am I? I might, I think I'm gonna die in this part because I really, really think I am. Okay, you know what, I'm gonna, oh my god, I almost killed myself there. Um, sh should I get this guy yet? No, nope, I didn't, no! Nope. Oh, sweet, no! Nope. No, nope, I want that, no! Get back here, oh my god, no, 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 kill yourself! Oh my god, I'm like shrieking right now. <laughs> okay, you know what, uh, forget it, just keep going Kirby, just keep going. I might kill my, I might die in this part so it's kind of ridiculous that I'm gonna die in the third part of this LP. I mean this is an easy game for crying out loud but we'll see I guess. Oh my god okay. No oh my god don't ah! oh my god okay can I get an enemy at least no no oh my god okay okay no dang it I can't believe I died wow Really impressive, Scab, and really impressive display of game work. Oh, jeez. Okay, there we go. I wanted the double plasma ability because it's much more better. Because you can um, expand your little shield thing or electrical field. Magnetic electro. Oh, oh my god, I can't talk to the electric magnetic field. Whatever. <laughs> well, at least I got my life back. Okay, now watch out for these. Shoot, I forgot what these enemies are called. I think they're called Zenons or something like that. Zebobs. I don't know. Alright, let's get a card here. And I got a one of instead. Well, okay. I missed it. I missed out a few attempts to get that card, but oh well. Anyways, boss time. Now when I was little, I had like major trouble with this boss. I don't know why. This boss is really easy. And yet I <laughs> I don't know, I had trouble with this boss when I was little. Like, I really did. I always died as boss. I don't know why. Maybe it was this phase that always gets to me. I always get hurt by this stage. Like, right now, the... By the way, this boss is called Pix. P-I-X. So, yeah. I don't know why. This phase always gets me. Especially this one right here with the green and blue... Or green and red diamonds. So, yeah. I don't know. This, this phase always gets me. Like, whenever they're attacking you, you have to dodge. So, yeah. And once you get all the way to the top, then you can hurt them. But right now, you can't. You have to dodge their attacks. So, yeah. Now, this phase is really easy. All they do is just go up and down. So, it's not that hard. But when I was little, yeah, it was hard for me. I always died in this boss. Which was 
really ridiculous. I mean, this is considered this is an easy game. It shouldn't be that hard to defeat Pit. So yeah. All right. Anyways, we're at the top now, so we get to fight. Awesome. All right, fight time. Okay. So you see that there there are colors, and if you attack with the same color, it does more damage. I mean, you can attack them with different colors and does a little bit of damage, but I'd rather destroy them with the same color that they have. Okay, you know what? I want to destroy you. Okay, green is gone, and they're gonna refill on these little things. Okay, now they're gonna spin. They have like a couple attacks, so it's kind of hard to get a good hit on them, especially when they're spinning like that. It's kind of hard to hit them. And I can never hit them in this in this attack form, so I can never get them. Oh, uh, can't they get them? Nope. Yeah, I prefer them just being separate, so yeah. Okay, so even though you use like a green one against a blue one, it does some damage, so ouch! Jeez. Way to be so nice to me. Alright. Okay, blue. Think oh, okay, never mind, I got it. Okay, red. You're not going down yet. Alright. And now you're down, and Pitts is defeated. All right, awesome. So we got all the crystals in the Rockstar and defeated the second boss of Rockstar, Pitts. On to the next planet. And I love this cussing, by the way. It's just one of my favorites in this game. You know what happens when we're walking in the desert, right? You see mirages, like an example right here. Kirby sees food on their faces. <laughs> Oh, Kirby, you're always hungry. Even in Mirage, you see food. But luckily, they got into lane with them. <laughs> and she can, you know, make food for them. But I got a question. Would that food be poisonous since it's paint? I mean, would she give them food poisoning? I don't know. I always question about that. What if Andalite accidentally kills them from po food poisoning from the paint in the food? I hope they're not poisonous. Anyways, on to the next planet. I kind of like this one. There's a few levels I like in the next planet. But we'll be doing that in the next part. So, I guess next time on Kirby 64, the Crystal Shard, we will go to Aquastar. So, I will see you guys then. So, this is Shaw Kirby 707 saying bye.